Folks, I'm making trailer bunks again. I crushed mine. Totally my bad this time. I broke the bolt. I broke the trailer. Everything is fine. I'm just gonna be out a few hundred bucks. But I wanted to show you something that I just found out. I like to do the trailer bunks myself because I think I'm, I'm doing them better than the ones that I would just buy from Bass Pro Shops or anywhere else. I get the 2x4. I like to round the corner where the boat is loading on that end so you know you don't hit an edge like this here which would tear the carpet from here on. I like to soften one of the corners and they, as you can see this is shiny because I just wrapped it in three layers of polyurethane. So this wood is now good to be wrapped in carpet. But I usually buy this whatever they sell marine carpet in Amazon and it comes in slices like this and it's kind of expensive. So this time I thought why do I keep wasting my money let me just buy some marine carpet from Home Depot. And it said outdoor carpet, marine carpet, but the gray carpet is not a good bunk, a trailer bunk carpet. Let me show you why. Look at the surface of the actual marine carpet that I used to buy on Amazon. Do you see these stitches here? There is backing. There is the stitches, there is actual backing on this carpet. This carpet will not stretch. I don't want I don't know how to show you, but if you pull like this, it will not stretch because uh, the thread here, the backing is it is keeping it. okay? The carpet that I bought, it has no it has no backing. It's actually thicker than this one I buy on Amazon. It is thicker if you want to use this as just carpet on top of your boat, it will work fine. But this carpet is not as strong because it has no backing. And if you pull like this, it is stretching right now. It will stretch, it will tear. Keep in mind guys, marine carpet is not all the same. If you are making your own trailer bunks, you need the one with the backing or you're gonna tear it in a couple of months and then you have to do it all over again.